Okay, guys, now I have added the second diode uh, from the earth ground. Only one wire coming in from here. These meters aren't really hooked up anymore. <coughs> no voltage divider, so I haven't turned it on yet. So let's see what happens. Hopefully it doesn't get too stupid. 40, 50 watts. Really climbs quick on the watts there. Way faster. Instantly 110 volts there. That's a good sign. 1500 volts here. All right. Let's see what happens. We'll let it run a little longer. It's quiet. There was no chatter on the fire up. 61, 62 watts. Climbing 70, 74, 75, 79 watts. Um, 300 volts. So that is charging proper fast. And like I said, we've only got um, the full, the half wave off the earth ground here, which I will can reconfigure this into a, you know, a, a device on its own. But uh, everything looks good that way. 289, slowly depleting because of all that resistance there. There's uh, what, eight. Uh, four, eight, twelve resistors there. So uh, if they're even five watts a piece, which is what they look like, or close, maybe they're three watts. Excuse me. Uh, they're gonna be burning it off. I did use one of those as a voltage divider here, and in seconds that thing was smoking. I mean smoking. It was hot. <laughs> so uh, we quit using that. But yeah, there you go. 230 volts. Charge that pretty damn quick. Let's just turn it on again for you. 230 volts. Um, we're pulling 67 watts and climbing at a rapid speed. Now, I don't know the details. This will probably keep pushing and pushing and pushing until it reaches 4,000 volts. And then it'll go open circuit because that's what this is kind of set up for. So there's 92 watts, 95 that was the highest I've ever taken that input. But there's 500, 400 and some volts there, like, in no time. Okay, guys. Do you want me to do it again? All right. One more time. Okay, so 92. We'll go to 100 watts. 96. You can see 100 watts. 102, 103 watts. And uh, 540 volts. Seconds. Ciao.